All right, I had a suggestion from someone to start with uh, a two-word start for all the math lovers. They want me to do frack and shins, which put together is kind of a homophone for the word fractions, of course. Uh, by the way, speaking of homophones, uh, you should go check out the video on my other channel that I did about homophones a few weeks back. If you haven't seen that, link in the description. Uh, hashtag shameless plug. Um, <laughs> Let's see, frack, okay, we, just, we got the C, which is good, because I often forget to check for Cs. Uh, shins, ooh, nothing from that. All we have is a C, ooh, that is interesting. Okay, so, definitely wanna do maybe O and or E, possibly a U. Um, let's see, we could do something like coped isn't terrible. Uh, L or T would probably be better than P and D, but... We could do clout might be better. Clout might be better because I like the L and the T better. And that checks two vowels instead of just one. Oh, the other one was checking O and E, I guess. Ooh, E's better than U, but L and T are better than P and D. I don't know, let's go with clout. It's fine. Okay, well, the L was good. Uh, e probably would have been good to check though because uh, it's looking like there's gonna be an E. Um, hmm, what would we have? Le Le leech? No, the C can't be there. Now we could have a Y, of course. But interesting, the C is interesting because we don't have a K or an H, the letters that C often goes with. Um, so, I don't, I don't know, um... If we if the C is second, then there's gotta be a vowel at the beginning, I think. So E C But then you've gotta have another vowel, unless it's a you know, an E or a Y is all we've got. E Cle E Cle. I'm just trying to <laughs> Uh Ooh, ooh, Excel! Excel! The filler X helps again. Um, at least, at least with coming up with an answer. I don't know if it's uh, coming up with a possibility. I don't know if it's the answer, but uh, I, I, uh, I don't usually like to jump to an X, but I really like this one. Uh, the double E. I feel like there's got to be two E's in the word. Probably new spot for the C and the L. I think I'm gonna go with Excel. All right, it was Excel. Interesting. So that is a little bit tricky. Now. You know, that's a hard word with the X, of course, and the double E, but we'd already ruled out all the other vowels. I feel like, I don't know, let me know if there's something else I should have guessed besides Excel. I feel like that was the only possibility at that point, but um, there's probably something else that could have been. So anyways, let me know if you think people have a lot of clout if they excel at fractions and how you did with today's Wordle, and be sure to subscribe for more puzzles.